Yeah. It's all about rhythm and timing. So. Can you put a percent on where you think you're at health-wise right now? Uh, I mean, I feel good enough to go. I feel like, and I'm and I'm only getting better. So. And what is the challenge like? I mean, you are able to make it back this week. You're going against Tennessee, the best offense in the league. Yeah. You excited about that? And, and can you get to the point where you think hey, I'm ready for this? Yeah, of course. I mean. Uh, I think yeah, they're leading the the, the league in, in passing yards and, and touchdowns, and all that stuff. So I think you know every week a team has a you know a certain identity, and, and they're definitely known for throwing the ball. So appreciate it. How does it, um, how does it feel just to be back, being able to practice after this one? Feels great, you know. Um, I was I was from the outside looking in, kind of like the the kid eating his lunch alone, but now I'm with everyone, so um, I'm excited. Do you have a chance this week, or is the process maybe going to be longer than that? I mean, I like to play this week, but um, I'll leave that up to the trainers and the coaches. Uh, I just take it one day at a time. So. How eager and rare, and have you been, and how excited are you? Very, process? very, yeah, very eager. But I also learned, like you know, um, certain injuries you you can fight through, certain injuries you can't. I heard I learned that the hard way. So. Uh, I take one day at a time. What were you doing to try to kind of get to this point to where you can be at least uh, designated for return? I mean, it's just constant, constant rehab, constant uh, body maintenance, uh, staying sharp mentally. So the transition from IR to, uh, to you know where I'm at now is is easy. And with that staying sharp mentally, you were still able to be involved in the DB meetings and all that. Yeah, 100 percent, and um, I, I was able to watch a lot more film than than I'm used to, and a lot. More than um, I think some of the players, just because you know they're out practicing, I'm in here. I got nothing else to do other than get treatment. So, go out there, have fun. Obviously, you know, a guy like Mahomes. I know you play quarterbacks all the time. Dez were able to make plays off off schedule, off script. What makes him so unique in that category? I mean, you know, you just turn on the film and look at it, man. As far as the throws, um, extending plays, um, you know, just you know, uh, this is the whole game. You know, just as far as you know. Uh, us having familiar, familiar um, with his game and playing him as well, you know, is, is enough for us to, you know, go out there and be prepared. What about the running the backs? Ball is snapped with, when, and, and as long as Mahomes is running around, when do you get to catch your breath? Is it when the play stops? Uh, is that the only time you can catch your breath against him? Uh, I mean, I'm not sure. You know, whenever whenever we can, I would say. Uh, it's going to be tempo. Uh, we got to get out there and watch from a prepared right way. I think we'll be all right. Nobody really talks about their running backs. How good are they? Are they kind of an underrated group for them, you think? Uh, I think they have a pretty good set of backs. Um, Tim, um, the, the rookie, he runs pretty hard. And then Clyde, he's been there. Um, he runs, you know, as well. And they have one change of speed, power. I think they have a nice little group there. You guys obviously go in with the same record. Do you allow yourself to think about the – you know, the swing aspect of this game in terms of seating and all that stuff and playoff position? That, it really doesn't. It's just another game for us. Um, you know, next person on schedule. And we go prepare the same way we've been preparing um, these last few weeks. You know, it's, it's been doing us right. You know, so just no change anything. You know, just uh, the same routine. You know, just go out there ready to play on Sunday. You know, just uh, pressuring, pressuring him, uh, putting him in tough situations. You know that he's a great quarterback. You know, and he's pretty much seen you know a lot of different looks. But uh, I just feel like as long as we're on the same page, you know, as a defense, uh, I feel like we'll do a great job. You know, I feel like we have done a great job in the past. You know, of mixing things up on him. So uh, that's going to be key for us. Mm. I've been here. We've gotten the best of them a little bit in the regular season, but obviously yeah. they won. Uh, I mean, I feel like that's the standard now for me, you know, so I, I have to be locked in at, uh, at all times. You know, there's been times where uh, I gave up a player or two, but uh, these games you can't get those up, you know, because it's a big game, you know, as far as being uh, in division, not division, but in the conference uh, opponent, opponent. And, you know, these games count, you know, later in the, later down the road too. So uh, it's just more of a reason, you know, to be locked in, you know, on everything that I have to handle. Yeah. 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 Right. Uh, not really, you know. But uh, it's in the back of my mind. I say that. But uh, you know, we just try to focus on you know one game at a time. And they're a playoff team. They have been for the past few years. So we know that we're going to be competing with them. You know, regardless down the road.